Hey guys, Adam from Equip to Endure. So, deja vu, seems like I'm doing this again. Bear Grylls, fail number two. All right, immediate release, August 16th, 2012. Reference, 12-24-8. Gerber recalls machete due to laceration hazard. Washington, D.C. The Consumer Production Safety Commission and Health Canada, in cooperation with the firm named below, today announced a voluntary recall of the following consumer products. Consumers should stop using the recalled product immediately unless otherwise instructed. It is illegal to resell or attempt to resell a recalled consumer product. Name of the product, Gerber Bear Grills Pering Machete. Units, about 119,000. Hazard, a weakness in the area where the handle meets the blade can cause the handle of the blade to break during use, posing a laceration hazard. Incidents, injuries. The firm received 24 reports of breakage, including one report of a laceration injury in Canada, sold at sporting goods stores nationwide, online since from January 2011 through June 2012, for about $43, the individual purring machete, and $349, the Apocalypse Survival Kit. Manufactured in China. Contact Gerber Legendary Blades at toll-free 877-314-9130. One three zero. That's eight seven seven three one four nine one three zero. Between nine a.m. and five p.m. Pacific time, Monday through Friday, or visit the firm's website at GerberGear.com. All right, guys. So there you have it. Another tragic incident in regards to the ultimate series of survival items brought to us by Gerber and Bear Grylls. So this was in the first fail. We did receive a fail on the ultimate knife. I know a lot of you have had comments and saying, oh, the picture was faked, blah, blah, blah. Well, hey, listen, guys, multiple pictures out there on the Internet, multiple videos of the tips breaking, the handles breaking, all kind of breakage on these knives, okay? Now we have a breaking of the Pering machete. Here's a picture of that here. So what is this saying? Well, unfortunately, the uh, quality of these Gerber items, uh, as many of you know, are poor. Uh, this is the second one of the series that's had issues like this. This is the first one that I know of having a recall. So check it out. I will have the link to this recall below. But just guys, be careful out there with this stuff. If you want a great Parang, try out the Village Parang of Condor. It is much better built for about the same price. It actually might be a little bit cheaper. So guys, I just want to put that one out there. Let me know what you guys think. Adam from Equip Door, if you have any questions or comments, please email me at adam at equipnador.com. You guys take care, be safe out there. Remember, if you're not always prepared, you're never prepared. Later.